I would never want to create a character that I didn't love with all my heart, that I couldn't really project myself into. So the struggles of the characters, I hope they become something that the audience can relate to and, and feel for, and that you know they genuinely hope that this couple figures something out. Hi, I'm James Ponsel. My film is called Smashed, and it's in the U.S. Dramatic Competition at the 2012 Sundance Film Festival. Smashed is an adult coming-of-age story um, about a married couple who are in their late 20s, they're pushing 30, but they're living like they're 10, at least 10, if not 15 years younger than that. The story um, explores fidelity and uh, what it means to be committed to someone and to love someone when you need to change your life, but they can't. And, you know, our characters happen to be uh, alcoholics. They have an ecstatic, bliss-filled, amazing, chaotic life together when they're drunk. The sad and ironic part is that one of them just can't, can't keep it up. She really can't handle it anymore. Smash was a collaboration between myself and my co-writer, Susan Burke, and she, Susan's a comedian here in Los Angeles. The story started from uh, you know, a, a lot of our own experiences with friends, family members who had struggled with addiction and alcoholism. We also both have a really motley collection of, uh, well, insane stories about things that we've done when we were, um, you know, not sober. We were both interested in making a story that was not a scared straight story, that was not a feel bad story. It was a story where you really identify with someone who's struggling, you know, with, with booze. It's not a down in the gutter story. Hopefully, um, Kate, you know, is someone that reminds you of your sister, your daughter, your ex-roommate, your ex-girlfriend, and you relate to her. When you first meet her, you may laugh at her and say, oh yes, I know that drunk girl. But as the film progresses, you go from laughing at her to laughing with her to really wanting to just grab her by the shoulders and shake her and you know hug her and embrace her and as she's trying to get her life together. I think my favorite kinds of stories are about characters who have major problems and are trying to, to get better, to fix themselves. It can be a Don Quixote quest where they're delusional or it can be something where they fail in the end, but as long as they're trying, I think there's real hope. It's the trying to me that's, that, that's where the hope exists. I was at the Sundance Lab several years ago with another project and it was, it was wonderful. The Sundance Institute has stayed part of my life. I hope with every film that I'm lucky enough to make that I'm able to sort of pay back that investment by making something good with heart and integrity.